Hey everyone, welcome to Brad's Gadgets. Today we've got not one, but two little mini tripods to review for you. Hey, that rhymed. That's pretty good. What I've got here is the Photo Pro UFO Mini and the Photo Pro UFO 2. These are just little little tiny tripods with a lot of potential. All right, so what all do you get in the box? Let's find out. We open up the box. We've got our tripod. We've got our instruction manual and a whole bunch of other little goodies. We've got a cell phone mount, where you can put your cell phone, you can mount it either like this on top, or we can mount it like this sideways. So that's a great little tool for you, if you're, especially if you're gonna be filming with your camera. We've got the GoPro mount. Okay. And that'll go right on here like this. And uh, let me just get the other one that I've got, which is already set up. And we're gonna put that on there, just like so. Boom, look at that. Perfect. Just works great. What other goodies do we got? We have one of these. And what are one of these? This is a little remote control. This is Bluetooth, you pair it to your phone, and then all you have to do is hit the little button and uh, you can take selfies and stuff with it. So you get all that for like 27 bucks. That's not bad at all. So the UFO 2, the UFO 2, is actually very, very strong. And to demonstrate that, I've got a Canon, 60D with a uh, 18 to 55 millimeter lens on it. So nothing overly heavy. And we're just gonna thread that onto the uh, quarter 20 connector on the back bottom here. And you can see, once I get it done, that it actually holds it pretty nice. Pretty steady. And if I wave it back and forth, you can see the uh, the legs here aren't giving out, they're not bending. Um, you know, that, that's a good amount of weight there that is keeping the uh, the legs here straight, right? I should say uh, that's counteracting. That's a good amount of weight, okay? So you're gonna find that a lot of bloggers tend to use these because they're pretty versatile. You can wrap them around a fence, you can set them up however you need. Um, the other day I was doing a time lapse on a uh, lift bridge and I just took this uh, UFO uh, stand with me with my GoPro and I wrapped it around a pole. They're super useful and the best part, they're super cheap. The uh, long one here, uh, I can't remember how many inches the legs are uh, right there if I do find it out figure it out you're only looking about $30 Canadian for these whereas the small one here which is great for GoPro or any small cameras uh, point and shoots or mirrorless or anything like that you're only looking about uh, eh, somewhere I think it was in the neighborhood about $26 Canadian you're gonna find that a lot of vloggers will use these. And uh, not just for the versatility, but for the value. They're not expensive whatsoever. So with that, let's go take a look and see some setups of how we can set these tripods up.
All right, so in comparison, the Photo Pro UFO Mini to the Gorillapod made by Joby, you just don't get the articulation out of it. It was good in its day because it's all we had to use. But now, in comparison, if you try to get that, that really tight squeeze on something, oh, look, look what happens. You break your leg off. So, needless to say, that's going in the garbage. This is going into my camera bag. And this. They both are. They're super lightweight, and there's no reason not to have one in your camera bag. Hopefully my video has helped you uh, decide whether or not one is right for you or not. And for the price, I just really can't see why not. Anyways, if you have a comparable tripod that you'd like me to check out, let me know in the comment section down below. Alternatively, if there's any other tripods out there that you'd like to see reviewed, let me know too and I'll do my best to review them. What mini tripod do you use in your case? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to hit the uh, like button there and subscribe. And uh, we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.